Michael Hurd booed and kicked Sussexes off their jet as Meg let her paid paparazzi letting them walk in during the concert. Last week, Prince Harry and Meghan Markle were seen socializing with billionaire Ken Griffin and internet guru Michael Keeves while visiting Las Vegas. The couple journeying to the vibrant metropolis in Nevada to attend Katy Perry's final performance at Resorts World Theater on October 11th. Prince Harry and Meghan were spotted in the audience at the concert venue. Previous indications were that Air Petroleum Company Michael H. and businessman Whitney Wolf, known for their commercial endeavors, were part of the tour group, and sources have verified that the Sussexes also interacted with investors, Griffin and Keeves. During a trip to Las Vegas, Griffin, a famous player in the financial industry, was placed next to Prince Harry at the founding concert of hedge fund company Citadel. He is set to own a fortune of more than $34 billion, according to Forbes. However, he is also observed sitting behind Prince Harry and Meghan during the concert. He's affiliated with the financial company K5 Global. His professional experience includes talent representation, specifically working with creative artist agency CA, formerly known as a different name. While there, he managed clients such as singer-songwriter Katy Perry, the Sussexes, and the Heard family, receiving invitations to Katy Perry's concerts through mutual acquaintances and, of course, Griffin's accompanying them to the occasion. According to a source, Kipps is a prominent influencer, and this meeting clearly demonstrates Prince Harry and Meghan's growing network. The source also questioned the nature of the conversations between Prince Harry and Griffin, implying that the conversations may have focused on issues related to power and wealth. Michael Hurd, wife of Whitney Wolf Hurd, arranged a private plane to fly them to Katy Perry's event. The jet is also used by famous individuals such as Cameron Diaz and her wife, or rather husband, Benji Madden, and actress Zoe Saldana. While not all of them are famous, the list of figures are recognized for their commercial acumen. The fascinating part is Meghan's approach to networking. Meghan's public relations team previously confirmed that Whitney Wolf, the creator of Bumble and former co-founder of Tinder, expressed admiration for Meghan. This leads to speculation about Meghan's efforts to form new social connections. The crisis intensified when photos of Meghan and the group were made public, which depicted Meghan's public relations team as being in a close relationship with Whitney Wolf. However, this decision has caused mixed reactions, with some individuals claiming that Meghan is trying to take advantage of the situation for personal gain, seeing a discrepancy between Meghan's behavior on the flight and at the concert, suggesting that events may not have gone as planned. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's Las Vegas tour included meetings with prominent individuals such as Kent Griffin and Michael Keeves. The publication of the photos and Meghan's strategic approach to building professional relationships have sparked debates about her motives and relationships within the billionaire community.